what is the meaning of hypertension? So the cardiovascular system mainly compo is composed of heart and the related vessels and a healthy heart contracts uh, beats 60 to 100 times per minute in a rhythmic manner and each time it contracts there is certain pressure occurring across the walls of the vessel which creates systolic blood pressure which is actually the bigger reading on the blood pressure measurements and during the relaxation phase of the heart there is diastolic blood pressure which is smaller reading on the blood pressure measurements when the blood pressure is exceeding 140 over 90 millimeters mercury in adults that's hypertension and it needs to be monitorized and treated as well so the prevalence of the hypertension worldwide is uh, 30 to 45 percent and 53.5 of those people are not even aware that they have hypertension so in order to increase the awareness of the hypertension and related diseases there on the 17th, 17th May uh, it's pronounced as the world's hypertension day. So we have to, even though we don't have hypertension, we have to check our blood pressure regularly. And if we realize that we have increased blood pressure, which is 140 over 90 millimeters mercury, we have to go to doctor. So why is hypertension important? Because when the vessels and organs are dealing with the increased pressure levels continuously, then there are some structural and functional changes. That leads to irreversible and sometimes mortal uh, diseases. Uh, for example, heart, eyes, brain, kidneys and vessels are the most pronounced organs which are affected by the hypertension. In heart, we can observe cardiovascular, uh, coronary artery or periphery uh, artery diseases, heart failures, increased tendency to arrhythmias, heart attacks. In cranium, in brain, we can see strokes, uh, cranial hemorrhages. In eyes, we can see decrease in vision. In kidneys, the decline of renal function, and also some dilatation of vessels such as aortic uh, dilatation. Studies provide evidence that uh, there is direct relationship between hypertension and cardiovascular diseases. Every 20 millimeters mercury in systolic and 10 millimeters mercury in diastolic increase is actually doubling the risk of uh, stroke. Stroke is third leading cause of the death in worldwide and after coronary artery disease and uh, cancers, unfortunately. So in a patient who presented with the stroke, they were observed uh, that 60% of those patients had the history of hypertension and 78% of those were with the inadequate blood uh, pressure levels.